trigger warning, most men are going to get pissed off at what I'm about to say. There's been a lot of talk going on recently about how black relationships are failing and uh, black marriage rates are low and uh, it's all black women's fault. Single mothers are the devil, blah, blah, blah. Single mothers destroy their children, you know. But I got a question. And I'm not joking with this. Before this woman was was a single mother, was she not first somebody's sexual partner? Because I swear to God, she was. People act like, and men in particular, act like uh, single mothers became that on their own. The thing that we we must do in black society, and, and this is the, the real ultimate truth of the matter, men must accept that we are overall responsible for the direction of society. We are overall responsible for where our women end up, how our children end up. It's all, it starts, stops, rises, falls, begins, ends, rests with us. If we do not, as a group of men, if we do not take care of our women, we have lost, right? If we do not put our women in a position to win, we're going to continue to lose as a race of people, period, point blank, end of story, bottom line. That may offend some, and that's fine, but guess what? The truth is offensive. If we as black people want to survive, the first thing that must be done is that our black men must see our black women as something more than just somebody to have sex with. And men, for those men that say, well, you know, it, it, it is a woman's fault when she's a single mother because she decides what happens to the baby when, the, you know, she's pregnant, blah, blah, blah. First of all, let's break this down. If you understand that, if you understand that women have the right to choose what to do with their bodies once a baby is in them, you have control of something. You have control of the seed. If her body is the soil, you have control of where you plant your own seed. Now, I don't know about you, brothers. But I would never plant my seed in soil that I know ain't fertile, ain't solid, ain't stable, ain't all that. If the woman you want or the woman you dealing with is not mentally stable, if she is not the kind of woman you could see yourself producing a child with, one, why you're sleeping with her in the first damn place, unprotected. Two, if you would not want to marry this woman, why are you sleeping with her and busting in her period? Does that make any sense? No. Because all you've done is create an 18-year minimum. <laughs> you've created an 18-year minimum tax bill that's going to forever bite you in the ass, period. And that ain't something that you want to always have to deal with, is it? No. Think better, do better. Stop trying to find your manhood through your penis, gentlemen. That part of Kevin Samuels I never did listen to, did you?